The Red Wings begin the preseason in Chicago tonight, but before training camp wrapped up yesterday, I sat down with Johan Franzen, who is preparing to return from his latest concussion. Johan's experienced numerous head injuries in his career, but he says this one took him to his darkest place. Johan Franzen hasn't skated in an NHL game in over eight months. The thought of suiting up for one is weighing on his mind. Nerves, excitement, what do you think? Oh, I'm going to be nervous. It's going to be so nervous. <laughs> But it's going to be great, too. That's the feelings that you miss when you're sitting out. Oh, and down on the ice, Bronson's hurt. Bronson has been sidelined since January thanks to his latest severe concussion. Missing that amount of time and uh, just not being able to do what you love it was really hard. How bad did it get? How down were you? I don't want to get lower than that ever again, but <laughs> it, was, it was tough. It's not fun. You never want to see a friend or a teammate feel like that, so, so obviously a normal life is the more, most important thing. Just before camp began, Franzen's doctor cleared him for game action. That news came after he spent the summer going through extreme workouts, only to admit his head would shut down afterward. Is your head still shutting down? Because a lot of people see that as a red flag. It's not like it turns completely off. No, it's not a switch like that, but it gets low, really low. The doctor I'm talking to is saying if I would get another hit, it's not super likely that that would worsen things. Still, that leaves a lot of people wondering why the 35-year-old would risk stepping out onto the ice and taking one more hit. Franzen has set a limit. If I would get a really bad hit again and I would feel the same way again, it's probably, that's probably it. I'm not going to go, go through it again, I, and I'm not going to put my family through that again. Right now, it's just, I'm not thinking about that. I'm just trying to do my best out there and have as much fun as I can. It's hard to listen to him to justify stepping back on the ice. His passion for the game is what brings him out there, and he said his family really helped him through that time. Johan said he feels like a 12-year-old with excitement right now, but you just worry what his body actually feels like as he steps back on the ice. Yeah, you just got to hope he's going to be, be okay and listen. Yeah.